What's up, you guys? My name is Mary, and with High Priestess Intuition, welcome my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel side, and you enjoy my content, if you can ring a little bell by my soul tribe, I super duper appreciate you saying, saying, saying. This is a um, weekly reading for sign of Sag. This could resonate if you have Sag in any aspect of your chart, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Moon, Hammer, Jupiter. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Um, the, I got one channeled in as I was meditating on your energy and the message I received was severe spamming. So you plug that in, how that resonates. So you could be severely spamming somebody or somebody could be severely spamming you. Like prank phone calls. Um, I'm thinking like prank phone calls or fraud energy or like spammy emails get you click on some clickbait or phishing or hacking or something like that. Or just prank phone call after prank phone call after prank phone call after prank phone call and it just annoys the crap out of you. Some kind of severe spamming energy. If you doing this or somebody connected to you doing this, you plug it in how it resonates, if that resonates for you. Um, all right, let's do it. This is free general reading, so it's important to only take the messages that resonate. I want to say real quick, thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. You guys have just been the best. Um, I appreciate every like, subscribe, share, and donation to the channel, even the dislikes, just saying. If you want to donate, it's High Priestess Row 5, the link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash out, no Venmo. Three of Cups Reverse, Princes of Wands Upright. A very spoiled Pisces is about to contact a Sagittarius. Always wanting, wanting, wanting. It's going to piss the Sagittarius off. Okay, so you plug it in how that resonates, if that resonates with you. Heard a very spoiled Pisces is about to contact uh, Sag soon. I heard that they always want, want, want. Um, it's going to piss you off. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, you're not going to be celebrating. You're not, you're not going to be partying um, because this is a spoiled Pisces energy coming into your life. I heard they always want. So they're energy succubus or money succubus. Sounds like energy time and money. Um, always wanting, wanting, wanting. They're coming off as a fire sign energy, but they're taking on the fire sign energy of desire, drive, and motivation to get something from you. Uh, I think for a lot of you guys, it's money. Just saying. But um, they're coming off as a Princes of Wands energy, which is a night energy, so like 18 to 35 esque energy. So, very, um, it can be an image, well, it's 18 to 25 energy, but you know, we live in 2021, so I'd say 18 to 35. But it's a very young minded individual. Um, and obviously, if they're just for some, they could be trying to get a loan from you, some just have wanting money from you, some they just want to take, take, take from you, basically. So, um, but they have lots of desire, drive, and motivation to, to do it. So I think you've given in to them in the past. I think you've given in to them in the past. And um, maybe for some, this time you're going to draw the line, possibly. Heard it's going to piss you off. So I think you might draw the line, possibly, this time. You plug it in, how that resonates, if that resonates for you. Um, you plug it in. They can, it could be masculine or femme Pisces. They could have Pisces in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or femme, Hamer, or Jupiter. Spirit messages to your opposite of Pisces. Princess of Cups reverse, six of swords upright. A very ungiving, unloving, unkind feminine energy is about to try to rekindle a love connection with you. 
You're going to be very leery of this. Okay, so you plug it in, how that resonates, if that resonates with you. I heard a very giving, unloving, unkind femme energy is going to try to rekindle a love connection with you. I heard you're going to be very leery of this. So this is the leery energy. You're going to be very leery of re reconciling in a love, romantic love connection with this person. Um, they're very ungiving, unloving, unkind towards you. And they're coming out as the Princess of Cups reversed energy. So like an 18 to 25-esque energy, very immature emotionally energy in here. Now, they could be 45 and be very emotionally immature, but this person is um, definitely immature emotionally. Um, and they obviously don't know how to treat somebody in a relationship. Um, I heard you be very, this is your Larry energy. Um, you could be masculine or femme, but it's a feminine energy trying to reconcile in a romantic sense with you, Sag, if that resonates with you. Share messages you have, Sana Sag. Queen of Pentacles reverse, Six of Cups upright. A feminine energy is about to lose her home soon because of drugs. For some of these feminine energies, they do not even own this home. It's going to piss them off in a huge way. They're going to come at you very angry. Okay, so you plug in how that resonates, if that resonates with you. I heard a feminine energy is about to lose their home soon. Some of these femme energies do not own the home, but some it's because of drugs and uh, they're going to come at you in a very angry way. So they're very unstable, ungrounded, unreliable, and dependable, but they're a drug user and they're about to lose it because there's drugs in their home is what it sounds like. That could be that drug raid energy I was pulling in last night. Um, that's exactly what I'm feeling for some of you guys, if this resonates with you. Um, and then um, Six of Cups Upright, I think this is you pulling away from this femme energy. Um because they're about to freaking lose their home and or for some you could help them out you could feel sorry for them and help them out but you plug it in how that resonates um but i mean something's going on to where there's about it sounds like there might be a drug raid or somebody might call the police on them and then the police find the drugs you plug it in how that resonates but they're going to come to you because of it so maybe they think you call the police on them maybe for some of them Spirit messages you have for time as such. Nourishment number seven could be very significant to someone, possibly. That could be age of you or somebody you're connected to. <clears throat> well, it can be you because we're all 18 and over, but it could be an age of a child you're connected to, possibly. It could be a lottery number, social, social number, green card number, date of birth number. It could be a lottery number, a significant number you see on billboards or advertisements. It could be um, something of that shape, form, or fashion. Nourishment. After several shocking series of shame events, a particular Sagittarius is about to really self-care themselves, really go within and figure out why they have made the choices they've made the past couple of years. Okay, so you plug it in, how that resonates, if that resonates with you. I heard after sh several shocking series of shame events, a particular Sagittarius is about to really go within, self-care and self-reflect and have some you time basically and um, figure out why you've made some decisions you made over the last couple of years. 
Some a secret gay relationship, some a spoiled doppelganger, for some given over stolen money, stolen money to someone they should not have. Okay, so for some of you guys, it's a secret gay relationship. For some, it's a um, given over secret stolen money to someone you shouldn't have and summon some kind of spoiled doppelganger energy. It could be a doppelganger you or somebody you're connected to, but some kind of spoiled doppelganger energy. So you're going to really self-care and self-reflect and go within and figure out why in the world you basically made these negative choices to bring yourself into this craziness. And because it sounds like you didn't balance out the universe, it, so, it sounded like you helped make it worse if this resonates for you. I'm not saying this is every single Sag in the universe or that watches these readings, but it's for somebody out there. And one particular Sagittarius is about to get a new vehicle. And a particular Sagittarius is about to have to lawyer up. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So one of you guys, you're about to, uh, sounds like purchase a new vehicle or a new to you vehicle. And one of you guys, I heard you're about to have to lawyer up. So lawyer up. So get some kind of legal repre representation because of something um, that's about to happen, it sounds like. You plug it in however that resonates. All right, you guys. I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices. I hope this helped and namaste.